If your ink too slow and your nib won't flow, here's one of the places that you can go. Larry is here to see you through with Mr. Announcer and Cubby too. It's Larry's Fountain Pen Reviews. No, come. Let's get with it today. Just came in hot off the press after I smashed my face in. And uh, let's see what's in it. Here we go. Got some peanuts. All right, we're going to have some fun with some ink pretty soon here. And uh, we got a few bottles of, what is it called, Mr. Announcer? Andorillium. Andorillium. Hey, thanks, Karen. Appreciate you, girl. I'll knock this out real soon for you. So here we go. And Oh, cool. Okay, we have Flying Squid Blue, Blue Ringed Octopus Blue, Vampire Squid Red, Cuttlefish Brown, Yay! Uh, Colossal Squid Dark, Come on with it. Spirula Green, I'm hearing it. And Something Bunting Blue, can't quite see the name, and I uh, can't see the name on this other one. Okay, but you can always go to Federalist Pens and Paper because I believe they're carrying this ink and they will be gladly to sell you all of it if you care to. And if you don't care to, they'll still sell you all of it. All right, so here we go. Oh, by the chance while we're still on here, how many people love the Swiss knife? I do. That's a pretty good knife. And here's another Swiss knife that I call a Swiss knife. So, yeah, they're, they're cool. And, of course, it's fabulous Roller Eel Black Ink. I love the Eel Black. Beautiful ink. Thank you, Mr. Well. So, I'm going to set that aside for now. And I'll probably have a drink later. Okay, here we go. We got one more. Now, this is one... Of my all-time favorites. Okay. And we'll save that. That'll come in handy on it. Sure will. Alright, here we go. Mont Blanc Blue Ink? Not really. Surprise, surprise. I'll never tell. Let's get this little dude open because the magic starts right in here. You know, what? when I saw this, I knew I wanted it. I knew I needed it. So, it's here. today, I think. 84 at one point. Yeah. I don't think we're going to have much of a winter this year. You? No, it, it's pretty mild. been pretty mild. Yeah, 
Here we go. Bear with me. Here we go. Almost done, I think. You? I think that should do it. Alright, let's try this. It's really like unpackaging your Christmas presents, maybe. Still working at it. It's working. Ta-da. Here we go. Now this is pretty valuable, and we'll uncover it, and we'll uncover it again, and get a nice close-up of that. Vanishing point, gone nip. It comes with two when I bought the pen, uh, a 14K medium, and I believe this is the extra fine. And uh, I purchased this one from Doc, and thank you, Doc. Uh, they, these are really, really super nice vanishing points. They're not your lower end. They're up higher. I will call them higher end pins. And it shows it, looks it, but I do like vanishing points. Uh, I guess they're up there on my top list. Why is that? Because they're easy to use, convenient, handy. And, uh, you know, one quick click, the nib comes out, another click, and right back in. So, it works well for me. And even though the uh, converters don't hold a lot of ink, that's okay with me. Because I, I'm an ink changer. I love changing out inks. So, it works well, well for me. And the uh, clip doesn't bother me, but we'll get to all this, <coughs> excuse me, at a later date. Peace and love, baby. It's all about you. So, be cool like your school. And don't forget this upcoming review on these awesome inks. Bye, Mr. Announcer. Bye. Bye. See you later. Bye.